All right, here's a quick one for Premiere Pro. Uh, let's say you want to extract this part of this edit right here. And as, if, as you can see, we do have a couple adjustment layers on top of it, and then this graphic asset, this cinematic bars, and all these uh, things. Usually you would go in and anyone start editing, cutting this, and then move over and then cut that, and then copying, selecting, and copying, and you know, you know how it is. There's a much easier way to do this, and that's basically using the lift command. All you have to do is just select the area that you want to extract, and that's this clip right here. And for that, there's two ways to do it as well, actually, with this clip selected and no other track activated, press the X key, which will select only this, this range, the, the length of this active clip here. It doesn't work when uh, other tracks are selected or active, pressing the X key will select this whole area of these other layers. Um, that's another quick workflow tip. But if not, just hold the shift key, snap to this edit, press the I key for an endpoint and the O key for an out point or select the context menu, mark in, mark out, okay? Now you've got this area selected and now use the lift command. You can find that command under where is it? Uh, hang on a second, I have to find it. Sequence, lift, it's right here. Because whenever I can, I use shortcuts, which I'm gonna do in this case as well. And the shortcut for this is the semicolon key. Boom. And now, control Z, undo. Doesn't look like much has happened, but watch, watch what happens now. When I do control V, I extracted this whole area, this whole area, without butchering my edit right here. Because I just want to keep this nice and clean. I don't want to copy it. And uh, you know what I mean? Like, um, don't have to do too much work. Extracting certain parts of your edit with multiple tracks um, is really easy with the lift command and control Z without even uh, butchering your edit. Okay, let's do one more time. This area maybe. I don't know, anything, I, O, lift, control Z, and boom, there it is, okay? That's a very convenient way to extract certain parts of your edit. If you have, like, of course, most of the times you're gonna have more than one track. As seen here, you have, what do we have? We have the cinema bars, then we have the color grading, then we have the basic uh, grading, and then the footage itself, okay? So that's probably going to be the case with your final edit as well. But many times yeah, you wanna mix and match things, maybe do a social media version, a shorter version. I don't know, like multiple scenarios that you can use this technique for, okay? So again, one last time, snap, endpoint, outpoint, lift, control Z. That's how it is. That's how it works. And when the, the moment you lifted this footage, it's in the, in the clipboard and then control V, it will drop it where you want to have it, okay? And that's this secret <laughs> technique with the lift command, which I really use a lot when doing alternative versions, iterations, social media versions and whatnot. So if you learned something new, feel free to hit the like button to help me promote this video. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Oh,